Okay, so I don't know how it plays out, obviously. And it's important to note and for the viewers here to understand that when you get prophetic dreams, it's typically pretty low resolution. It's not like a, it's not typically a very, very detailed picture. And it can't be. There's many reasons for that. I mean, you, God can only show you so much. And, and the other part of it is that to understand the full big picture of what's coming, you have to get information from lots of different people. This is one of the reasons I take the approach I do on this channel where I direct people towards the playlist because I get lots of prophetic dreams about World War Three, but I still only get part of the picture. A lot of my dreams are focused on New Zealand. I seem I've had I've put out more prophetic dream warnings of visions from God of what I've been shown will happen in World War Three in New Zealand than anyone else on YouTube. But then I'm not getting much about what's happening in most of Europe. Then other people are getting a lot of that information. A lot of people are getting other, you know, a lot of Americans are getting a lot of information about what what happens in the US. So you need to see the big picture. There are reasons prophetic dreams are given in the way they are from a spiritual perspective, from a 30, 30, 35,000 foot view, <laughs> big picture perspective. Incidentally, I should point out, this is one of the reasons why I don't recommend Celestial from the Master's Voice. You can learn some good stuff about from her about spiritual knowledge, but it's clear to me uh, so the guy, I'll put a link to his channel in the description box below. I think his name is Ali. I'm, I'm, I'm not actually sure of his name. Sorry, off the top of my head. But he runs a channel. I think it's called The Watchman's Circle. And then Hoyt Sigmund. I'll put a link to his channel in the description box below. Both of them and me, all three of us, agree that there's issues, serious issues with Celestial from the Master's Voice. And... You can tell she's lying about some of her dreams because one of the things she does when she talks about some of her prophetic dreams is she goes into crazy amounts of detail and she talks about how she could read like entire paragraphs on books in her dreams and then she remembers them when she wakes up. Like, n if you have experience in this area, that's not possible. It just doesn't happen. Even the best of us don't get dreams where we get that much detail and we, w we wake up and it's like a movie and we can remember crystal clear like 40 pages of detail it just there's lots of other red flags she's very arrogant she's very prideful she's very self-righteous you can learn some good stuff from her but i don't recommend her channel so that's a little bit of a side but it's also context for what i'm about to explain now yeah just one final point about celestial's channel i'm not meaning to criticize her but i'm not saying you know like hate her or you know have a go at or anything it's not very loving christian behavior i'm just saying be aware that there's some stuff going on there so you can learn good stuff from her but personally i you know make up your own mind i don't recommend her work uh, at least in terms of the prophetic dream material i did however learn a lot of her, from her about spirituality and christian principles and i rec could recommend her videos from that perspective i personally would not recommend her prophetic dream warning material uh because yeah the serious issues all right moving on so yeah, I mean, that's one of the things you get from hers. I've still got her videos in my playlist, incidentally, because actually there is the ones she's had about World War Three. they do, to be fair, coincide with the information most of the rest of us have got about it. But yeah, one of the issues there you can see is she, she talks about how the US is such a terrible country and it will be defeated and destroyed and it will be gone forever. And that's not like I and others have been shown we win the war. And actually God's told me that the US is more spiritually advanced than China and a lot of these other countries. And that's the reason we're going to win. I've basically been told and shown by God that the US and our, other, our countries are corrupted, but we're still inherently good. Most people, the core of our countries is good. We're just super, super corrupt. And yeah, so we're not going to, we're going to lose initially, but we'll win in the end because democracy and capitalism are better than communism. I'm sorry. <laughs> and, and spiritually, uh, we are, our core is strong and better, but we're just very corrupted. So that's why we're going to be defeated initially. But that when we get back to the core of who we are and that goodness and that tree of life, that, you know, the source of life of just that connection to God through the whole and the Holy Spirit and our Christian roots. Yeah, that's when that's why we'll win. And, you know, she said the US will be destroyed. It's just BS. I'm sorry. It's not going to happen. So 
yeah, like I can't honestly tell you in detail what happens next in terms of how Russia wins the war in Ukraine because I don't know and none of us know. But we've been given, many of us, low-grade kind of low-resolution images and movies in terms of what we've been shown in prophetic dreams of what will happen. And I just want to do a correction here. So two things. If you go back to the video that I posted on April the 19th, 2022, 15 months ago, where I share the second prophetic dream from God I had about the Ukraine war. In that video, I share the details of what I was showing about how the war ends. I just want to make a quick correction before this happens, because I know Russia is going to take Ukraine. In that video, I talk about how God showed me that Russia would take Ukraine in, quote, two weeks. In that video, I subsequently went back and I corrected it in the description box below that I now think that two weeks is probably not literal. It's just symbolic for it happening very quickly, but I want to do it. But when I corrected that in the description box, I mean, you can do that anytime. So <laughs> I want to have it on record on a video that I'm publishing tonight that in that video where I talk about how I was shown Russia taking Ukraine in two weeks in this prophetic dream from God. I now believe that two weeks was kind of symbolic for very quickly. I don't actually think it's even possible that Russia could take all of Ukraine in two weeks. I, I, maybe, maybe it was literal. I don't think so, though. I think it was kind of symbolic for, for saying like it'll happen in you know a fortnight very quickly. But I don't actually think it will happen in two weeks. I, yeah. To repeat, I just don't even see how that's possible. So that's yeah, the one correction I want to make. I have to put that out there on the public record because this is going to happen. <laughs> and I want to make sure I, I, I've clarified and corrected it. My prophetic dream warning from God of you know the movie of Russia taking Ukraine before that happens. That's the first point. Second point is I want to direct you to the latest blog post from Jan de Villiers and he was shown that this is going to be a massive, uh, he's referred to it as a mega attack, massive Russian ground invasion and like just ground attack. And the gloves are about to come off basically is what he's been shown. And if you read that blog post, you'll see he was shown missiles, Russian missiles slamming into kind of upper class bougie Ukrainian apartment buildings. And the, sim and the buildings were on the left he was seeing them on the left. These were actually visions, I think, not even dreams. If you check, if you read the blog post, link in the description box below. And then the, the missiles were coming from the right. So this for him represents that, yeah, the gloves are about to come off and we are going to see this massive Russian attack. And this is, I bring this up in the same video where I do the correction to that, you know, video I posted 15 months ago because we're all being shown similar things. And yeah, he's been shown this massive escalation where they, they just go to take all of Ukraine. And uh, well, he didn't get shown exactly that. I mean, I got shown that. But this dream is essentially a snapshot of something very similar to what I was shown. And if you go back to that, I'll put the link in the description box below just so you can quickly find it and you don't have to scroll through my video list to find it. If you go to the back to that video I posted 15 months ago, you'll see that I post in the posted in the description box for that links to some other videos from other Christian YouTubers who had been shown exactly the same thing, that Russia will take all of Ukraine in a lightning fast, like blitzkrieg type operation. So yeah, we can now add yarn to the list of people who's been shown a kind of a, a similar type of event that's coming in the near future, like huge escalation that yet gloves come off. And then like I've said in other videos, this isn't even it really. They've just been sparring like in boxing, just, you know, just, just warming up and they've been testing weapon systems and tactics, feeling each other out. And well, I think Russia has, I'm not sure our side has, but when the gloves come off, you're going to know about it because it'll be pretty quick. And relatively speaking to how long the war's gone on before this blitz, blitzkrieg operation is initiated and it will, it won't take long. They'll take Ukraine pretty quickly. And others have been shown, I mean, it's now been confirmed. I had a, I was shown that in that prophetic dream on the 
21st of December 2021, I was shown that China in the future would be supporting Russia's invasion of Ukraine by supplying them with military equipment. I posted a video, I think over six, about five or six months ago, to a, with a link to a news article that confirmed that. So that that's fulfilled. That's another prophet's dream, prophetic dream I've had that's now fulfilled. But it's like we've had even more confirmation since that since then. Now it's very obvious China is supplying a ton of military equipment to Russia, but others have seen. Yeah, North Korea coming in too. So we might actually see in the end when Russia does this Blitzkrieg operation, Russia, uh, Russian troops, Belarusian troops, we could even see Chinese, not just Chinese military gear and North Korean military gear. We could also see Chinese and North Korean troops. So tr troops from four countries. And then, I mean, they've got mercenaries from many countries all over the world on their side, just as we do on our side supporting Ukraine. And Ar Iran is already supplying a ton of weapons to Russia, such as these Shahid drones. I'll put a link to what they are in the description box below if, you don't, if you're not familiar, if you haven't been following the war too closely. And Iran has recently uh, agreed with Russia to build a manufacturing facility, a factory to produce those drones on Russian territory. So, yeah, we can see the sides forming and... Yeah, I believe that Blitzkrieg mega attack, as Jan de Villiers refers to it, is imminent. He had that dream about it, which is in line with what everyone else has seen. I just wanted to make that clarification to that video I posted in, on April the 19th of 2022, 15 months ago to, yeah, just make sure I'm, I've got all my ducks in, my ro in a row <laughs> and I'm comfortable with the picture that I've put out of the prophetic warning I had about that event before it fulfills and I would bet you as much money as you want anyone it's going to fulfill it's only a matter of time but you know make up your own mind refer to the disclaimer in the description box below and yeah check out Jan's blog later the latest blog entry I think it's, it's pretty interesting what he was showing and uh, yeah we can we can get a low resolution grainy kind of you know, it's like video camera footage from the early 90s as opposed to 720p YouTube video today on a smartphone. And we can get a movie of that kind of early 90s handheld camcorder quality in terms of what we're showing in our prophetic dreams, a rough sense of what it's going to look like. But, you know, the details, we, we'll have to wait and see for that. I believe it's going to happen. I would be surprised if it doesn't. We'll see how, how things play out. Thanks.